They just want to talk to you. If you get caught with that, you're going to be looking at a stretch. Well, look. OK, so, so say you, you managed to blag it by some miracle. What are we supposed to tell them? Now, you can't just disappear when you're on bail. Well, you'll have to think of something. Oi. What's going on, then? Get Jack and Sarah. We should be at the gate. Give me the boarding passes. Just take a next week with your mum like we've arranged. No. No, Mum can't take her next week because her treatment starts tomorrow. You've had this planned all along, haven't you? No, I haven't. But she got upset and I couldn't do it. She is my kid and I belong with it there in that hospital. End off. It's not that easy, is it, eh? Not after the stunt that you pulled in France. I'm not leaving her. I promised. OK, right. So you want her there tomorrow? I can sort this, um... I'll go home, I'll get some stuff, and then we'll get her on a flight later. Then who's going to keep their eye on Debbie? I've got mine here, and I've checked at the desk, and they've still got tickets for your flight. No way, that's not happening. If Debbie's heart is set on Sarah going today... No, Sarah has to go today, because the treatment starts tomorrow. There you go. I'm not having you use Sarah to worm your way back in. I won't leave her for a minute, and we'll phone you every night. Yeah, not unless you're out on the town with some bloat that you've pulled. I'll look after her, love. Not like she was my own, cos I messed up with that spectacularly. But like the mum, I wish I'd been. Passengers boarding flight CF653 Prague. Please make your way to gate 10 now. Give me the boarding passes. Debbie, you can't do this. You go through that again, now you're going to get yourself arrested. Or when you come back. I suppose the other option is you could always stay in Prague. I mean, how's your cheque coming along, eh? Just stop it, please. Your dad was right. Getting you that passport was a bad idea. Stay here and talk to the police. Just get them off your case. So it's all gone away by the time Sarah comes back. Sarah, come on, give me the passes. No, I'm going with Granny Faye. Uh, uh, I've just checked in. Oh, how fit am I going to be after two months looking after you, young lady? <laughs> hey. You can tell Moira I found a good use for her money. Sarah. She's family. But you have to look after Mum. She's not worrying about me. No, I'm going to do that. Eight weeks of the treatment, I should be with you. I made you a promise, Debbie. I won't let you down. Mum. OK, right. You do the first few days a week, tops. Then me, Chaz and your mum, we go over and take turns, OK? We're going to need a bigger hotel room. <laughs> I'll phone you every day. Send me pictures of Jack. <laughs> You're my big brave girl, OK? And I love you. I love you too. I'm the worst, Mum. No. <laughs> You're the best because you've let her go. 